Sometimes you win, sometimes you learn. The journey that we have started this season with 3,11,342 spellers, for us, all of them are winners. And those who are watching our show and learning through Spelling Bee, we wish you will join us soon and become a winner. Hello and welcome to the fourth season of the Daily Star Spelling Bee Enlightened by Summit brought to you by Champs21.com in association with Bloop. I'm Romana Malik Munmun along with our official financier, Mrs. Anad Rabbani, will take you through this journey. I'm going to show you how to get out of the Chargeon semi-finalists. And the semi-finalists round is a very difficult level. But I'm sure our four spellers are very well prepared. Before we start the contest, let's get introduced to them. At first, we have Saqib Ahmed representing Sulet, student of Anand Niketan. Welcome, Saqib. <laughs> After that, we have Mohammed Sadiq Sadman, student of Chittagong Collegiate School, representing Chittagong. <laughs> Next, we have Chaudhary Nabila Tasnim, student of Cardiff International School. Welcome. And finally, we have Tausif Hussain Khan, student of Mirzapur Cadet College, representing Tangail. Welcome. <laughs> all right. I think Saqib has a message for all other spellers. Will you please share it with us? Uh, to do good in this com uh, competition, you have to be confident and skillful. If you have both confidence and skill, you, um, the trophy will be in your hands in no time. All <laughs> so right. I, I hope you follow this. Uh, suggestions <laughs> all right definitely thank you very much viewers remember these four spellers are amongst the top 16 spellers from all over the nation and now it's time to start our first round which is spell it as you know when spell it will be asking you five words to spell within 20 seconds you'll have to start the spelling you'll be given the English meaning you can ask for Bangla meaning as well as parts of speech and now for five words, if correctly spelled, you can easily earn 75 points. All right, all the very best. We'll start with you, Saqib. Saqib, the first word is incendiary. Incendiary, and it means designed to cause fire. The word is incendiary. So it's I-N-C-E-N-D-I-A-R-Y, incendiary. That is correct. Very good start, 15 points. The second word is heraldry. Heraldry, and it means the study of the coat of arms and the history of old families. The word is heraldry. H-E-R-A-L-D-R-Y, heraldry. That is correct. You want to. The third word is glissando. Glissando, and it means a continuous slide upwards or downwards between two notes. The word is glissando. So it's G-L-I-S-S-A-N-D-O, glissando. That is correct. Well done. The fourth word is gazetteer. Gazetteer, and it means a geographical index or dictionary. The word is gazetteer. Is it G-A-Z-E-T-T-E-R, gazetteer? Very, very close, but that is incorrect. The correct spelling is G-A-Z-E-T-T-E-E-R, gazetteer. Oh, that was really close. Anyways, one more word left. All the best. Sakib. The final word is Reichstag, Reichstag, and it means the main legislature of the German state. The word is Reichstag. Can you repeat the word? Reichstag. R-E-I-C-H-S-T-A-G, Reichstag. That is correct. Beautiful. 15 points. Well done. In total, you have earned 60 points from this round. Moving on to our next speller, Sadiq. Let's go. Sadiq, the first word for you is Loathsome. 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 And it means repulsive or causing hatred or disgust. The word is loathsome. L-O-A-T-H-S-O-M-E. Loathsome. That is correct. 15 points. Good start. The second word is holarctic. 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 And it means relating to or denoting a zoogeographical region. The word is Holarctic. H O L A R C T I C. Holarctic. That is correct. Two on two. Good going. The third word is Chanteuse. 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 And it means 
a female singer of popular songs. The word is Chanteuse. C H A N T U T E U S E. Chanteuse. Sadiq, we cannot take it. That is incorrect. The correct spelling is C H A N T E U S E. Chanteuse. Sadiq. Once you have started, go slow. There's no rush then, okay? But just start within 20 seconds. It's okay. It's okay? Go for the next one. Good luck. Sadek, the next word is impasse. Impasse, alternately pronounced as impasse. And it means a situation in which no progress is possible, especially because of disagreement. The word is impasse or impasse. I M P A S S E impasse. That is correct. Back on track. Well done. Fifteen more points. The final word is hachek. Hachek, and it means a mark placed over a letter to indicate modification of the sound. The word is hachek. 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 H A T C H E C K. Hachek. That is incorrect. The correct spelling is H A C E K. Hachek. Very well played. 45 points from this round, Sadiq. Don't be so upset. Three more rounds to go. All right. Moving on to Nabila. All the best. Nabila, the first word is grandiloquence. Grandiloquence, and it means pompous or extravagant in language or style, especially in a way that is intended to impress. The word is grandiloquence. G R A N D I L O Q U E N C E. Grandiloquence. That is correct. That was a 14-letter word. Well done. The second word is grenadier. Grenadier, and it means a soldier armed with grenades. The word is grenadier. G R E N A D I E R. Grenadier. That is correct. 15 more points. The third word is. Doppelganger. Doppelganger. Doppelganger, and it means a double of a living person. The word is doppelganger. D O P P E L G A N G E R. Doppelganger. That is correct. That is again 12 letter word. Good job. The fourth word is magia. Magia, and it means a member of a people who originated in the Urals. The word is magia. M A G Y A R Magia. That is correct. Four on four. Very good. Last word for you. The final word is champlive. Champlive, and it means animal work in which hollows made in a metal surface are filled with colored animals. The word is champlive. Champlive is the word. C H A M. P L E I V E T, Champlive. Very, very close, but that is incorrect. The correct spelling is C H A M P L E V E, Champlive. But very well played, 60 points. Well done. Tausif, it's your turn. Good luck. Tausif, the first word is marmalade. Marmalade, and it means jam or jelly, eaten specially for breakfast. The word is marmalade. M A R. M A L A D E, marmalade. That is correct. 15 points. The second word is Illuminati, alternately pronounced as Illuminati, and it means people claiming to possess special enlightenment or knowledge. The word is Illuminati or Illuminati. I L L U M I N A T I, Illuminati. That is correct. Two on two. The third word is Grommet, grommet, and it means a small metal ring placed around a hole in a cloth or leather to make it stronger. The word is grommet. The spelling is G R O M E T, grommet. Close but incorrect. The correct spelling is G R O M M E T, grommet. Oh, that's okay. Two more words left. All the best. The fourth word is chanticleer. Chanticleer, and it means a name given to a domestic animal, especially in fairy tales. The word is chanticleer. Alternately pronounced as chanticleer. 
The word is Chanticleer or Chanticleer? C-H-A-N-T-I-C-L-I-E-R. Chanticleer. Very close but incorrect. The correct spelling is C-H-A-N-T-I-C-L-E-E-R. Chanticleer or Chanticleer. Oh, that's okay. Last word for you. The final word is Ecoche. Ecoche and it means a painting or sculpture of a human figure with the skin removed to display the musculature. The word is Ecoche. A C O U C I. Ecoche. That is not correct. The correct spelling is E C O R C H E. Ecoche. Well tried. 30 points. Not a bad score. It's okay. And that brings us to the end of our first round. Viewers. Blue Pair Show Jun is spelling the account Shabar Juno. Upna the Android phone a Google Play Store take a download coron in Amad Champs 21 app even kill the Thakun, spell Champs game, Jotu Ichet Toto Bar. Season Shisha Upna the Motu take a top 30 scores with the Jatsen, Akoshuni Purushkar, Blue Pair Show June. We'll now go for a short Champs 21 break. Please don't go anywhere because after the break there are three more exciting rounds waiting. Stay tuned. <laughs> You are watching the semi-final of the fourth season of the Daily Star Spelling Bee, enlightened by Summit, brought to you by Champs21.com in association with Bloop. Virodhi te jawara ke amra shesh kore gaye chilam pratham round. Chuno dekhi nai pratham round shesh score ki dariye chhe. Sakib at 60 points. Sadik at 45 points. Nabila at 60 points. And Tausif at 30 points. Now get ready for the second round, Spell Hive. In Spell Hive, you know you'll have to crack five words. The first word is a four letter word. We'll give you the first letter of the first word. You can ask for the last letter of the first word. In that case, you're playing the Hive for 45 points instead of 50. Total time, 90 seconds. All right, ready to go? Yes? Yes. yes. All right, moving on, Sakib, all the best. Sakib, the hive is on your screen. The first word starts with the letter R. The first word means a hard surface built for vehicles to travel on. The second word means love and respect deeply. The third word means moved about or traveled aimlessly. The fourth word means a colleague or a fellow member of an organization. And the last word means estimated similarity or dissimilarity between and your time starts now. Is the first word road, R-O-A-D. That is correct. Is the second word adore, A D O R E? That too is correct. Is the third word roamed, R O A M E D? Roamed. That is correct. Is the fourth word comrade, C O M R A D E? Comrade. Correct as well. The last word means estimated similarity or dissimilarity between. You have enough time. Is it, is it compared? C-O-M-P-A-R-E-D? Compared? Five out of five. That's a nicely built hive. That's like scaling the summit. Splendid. 50 points from this round. Moving on to our next speller, Sadiq. Let's start. Sadiq, the hive is on your screen. The first word starts with the letter R. The first word means cause a bell or alarm to ring. The second word means strong feeling of annoyance, displeasure, etc. The third word means a thing used to hang clothes from a rail. The fourth word means a person or a thing that alters something. And the last word means arriving at and your time starts now. The first word means cause a bell or alarm to ring. Do you need the clue? Yes, I need the clue. It's a G. The last letter of the first word is a G. Is it ring, R-I-N-G, ring? That is not correct. Okay, don't worry, you have two letters. Use those. Go on. The second word means strong feeling of annoyance or displeasure. Look at the meaning. Is the second word grief, G-R-I-E-F? That is not correct. Okay, okay, go for the next one. The third word means a thing used to hang clothes from a rail. Look at 
look at the meaning carefully and think of common words. Meaning, please. A thing used to hang clothes from a rail. Read the meaning carefully. How about the fourth word, which means a person or a thing that alters something? Is the fourth word changer, C-H-A-N-G-E-R? That is correct. All right, 10 points. Go on. The third word means a thing used to hang clothes from a rail. Just get rid of one letter. Ah, time's up. Sadiq, the first word was rang, R-A-N-G. The second word was anger, A-N-G-E-R. The third word was hanger. H-A-N-G-E-R, and the last word was reaching, R-E-A-C-H-I-N-G, reaching. Oh, a little disappointing, but anyways, 10 points. Well tried. Moving on, we have Nabila. Let's start with your one. Nabila, the hive is on your screen. The first word starts with the letter S. The first word means to travel on water using engine. The second word means a passage between rows of seats in a train. The third word means an act of going down a steep cliff or rock. The fourth word means off or like a beast. And the last word means right or appropriate for a particular purpose. And your time starts now. Is the first word, first word sail? Is that I'll sail? That is correct. 10 points. Is the second word ail? A-I-S-L-E. The word is isle, and that Isle. is correct. Move on. The third word means an act of going down a steep cliff or rock. You can try other two. How about the last word, which means write for a particular purpose? Letter to the second word, you'll get the third. The third word means an act of going down a step, cliff, or rock. Half a minute left. The third word means an act of going down a steep cliff or rock. Why don't you try the fifth one? The fifth word means write or appropriate for a particular purpose. Is it a fourth word B-E-S-T-I-A-L? That is correct. Very good. Ten points. Move on. Anyone? Last word. Last one. Quickly. Ah, oh, time's up. Nabila, the third word was abseil, A-B-S-E-I-L. And the last word was suitable, S-U-I-T-A-B-L-E, suitable. All right. Not a bad score. 30 points from this round. Moving on, we have Tausif ready to go. Good luck. Tausif, the hive is on your screen. The first word starts with the letter P. The first word means not mixed or adulterated with any other substance. The second word means become active and eject lava from a volcano. The third word means a kind of pigeon able to inflate its crop. The fourth word means a particular position of the body. And the last word means produce new leaves or buds and your time starts now. The first word pure, P U R E. That is correct. Third word posture, P O S T U R E. The third or the fourth word? Fourth word. P O S T U R E, posture. That is correct. All right, move the on. The fifth word is sprouted, S P R O U T E D, sprouted. That is correct. All right, you have more than a minute, so take your time and go for the rest two. Is the, the second word erupt, E R U P T, erupt? Correct as well. The third word means a kind of pigeon able to inflate its crop. If you don't know the word, try with the letters. Add one to the second or get rid of from the fourth. Is the third word T R O U P E trope? That is incorrect. Okay. There is still more time left, but can we have the words, please? The word was powder, P O U T E R, powder. But very well done. 40 points from this round, Tausif. Good job. Relax a little bit as we are going to start our third round, which is Spell Ring.
In spell ring, we're giving you nine letters with a central letter in it. You'll have to form four small words containing minimum four letters and each one will give you five points and a longer one containing all nine letters which will give you ten points. Now remember all the four words must include the central letter. Total time 45 seconds. All the best. We'll start with you Saqib. Saqib, the ring is on your screen and the central letter is an A. You better start uh, giving this word. Okay. G E A R gear. Go on. R A G E rage. Go on. G O A T goat. Go on. N E A T neat. Go for the longer one. Anything coming up in your mind? Quickly, quickly. Ah, time's up. Sakib, the first word you said was gear, G-E-A-R. The second word you said was rage, R-A-G-E. The third word you said was goat, G-O-A-T. And the fourth word you said was neat, N-E-A-T. And all four of them are correct. And the long word which you missed was generator, G-E-N-E-R-A-T-O-R, -E -E generator. Good job, 20 points from this round, Sakib. Moving on to Sadik, ready to go? All right. Sadik. The ring is on your screen and then the central letter is an A. B A S E B A S E base. R A T E rate. B A S T E base. Go on. F A S T fast. Go for the longer one. Anything? Time's sure. up. Sadiq, the first word you said was base, B A S E. The second word you said was rate, R A T E. The third word you said was based, B A S T E. The fourth word you said was fast, F A S T, fast, and all four of them are correct. And the long word which you missed was breakfast, B R E A K F A S T, breakfast. All right, you got your 20 points from this round, Sadiq. Well done. Nabila, let's start with your one. Nabila, the ring is on your screen, and the central letter is an E. R A T E rate, go on. F A T E fate, hmm? C I T E sight, R I T E right. Very fast, go for the longer one. A R E S I E C A T. You have enough time. Quickly, five seconds. Anything, anything coming up in your mind? Anything? Ah, okay. Time's up. Nabila, the four words you said were R A T E rate, F A T E fate, C I T E sight, R I T E right. All four of them are correct. The long word you missed was cafeteria, C A F E T E R I A cafeteria. Oh, that's all right. Twenty points from this round, Nabila. Now let's start with Tasif's one. Good luck. Tasif. The ring is on your screen. Central letter is an E. The first word is R A T E rate. Move on. F A T E fate. Move on. T E A R T R. Go on. Anything? N-E-A-R, near. All right, longer one. And your time's up. Now, Sif, the four words you said were rate, R-A-T-E, F-A-T-E, fate, T-E-A-R, tear, and N-E-A-R, near, 
are all correct. The long word you missed was fortunate, F-O-R-T-U-N-A-T-E, fortunate. All right, well done, 20 points from this round. And this brings us to the end of our third round. Viewers, if you have a school-going child in your family, then each member of the family must visit champs21.com on a regular basis because you'll find there a lot of educational material for students, teachers, and parents. Going for a short Champs21 break? Please stay tuned. <laughs> watching the semi-final of the fourth season of the Daily Star Spelling Bee, Enlightened by Summit, brought to you by Champs21.com in association with Bloop. Viewers, we are going to be able to learn a lot about our lives. We are going to be able to learn a lot about our lives, and we are going to be able to learn a lot about our lives. And we are going to be able to learn a lot about our lives, and we are going to be able to learn a lot about our lives. We are going to be able to learn a lot about our lives. एक जो शिक्षक के दायित्व शुद्ध मात्र क्लासे पाठदान करना है। He is in fact a guide, a philosopher, a friend, above all a mentor to his students। छात्रों के साथ ये आमर खूबी आंतरिक संपर्क को चिलो क्योंकि वे अमुनो बोले थे, sir you are like my father। ताचरा ये बहुत से छात्रों रा गुल कोरी, गुल कोर्बे, तारा तादिल लाइन के ओवर स्टेपिंग कोर्बे, सबसे विशेष चीज़ टा प्रोजेक्शन, शेठ होला मोटिवेशन, नॉट एडमोनिशन। एक टा चिले चिलो महमूद नाम क्लास नाइन एर, शे एक दिन पीटे ते उन्हों पोस्टेड चिलो, किंतु शे पढ़े थोड़ा पढ़े, तो अकुन शे आमन नंबर ले दे, बोले आजीजुल किंतु शुद्धि शे एक ऑल मैगज़ीन कुनो कास करेंगे शेदी तो आमी तो वो तो फ़ोन एडजुरेंस है कि दिलों पंथी बोल लाम जे हैं आमी शे शुद्ध तो ही बोल ची अनेक बार तो भागते पड़े न जे इबाबे छात्रों को खो ना आटा होता मैं ठीक करेंगे इन दामर का से मनोहर चिलो शे मूर्ते आमी जनो ठीक कास ठीक करे चिल जेकने कैडेट रावस्थान करे ताकि तो अपन मामू देश तो हमारे देखा हुए चिलो शे आम के जोरी धोरे और जोरे करना कटी करे चिलो शे तो अपन आम का से माप चे एक पौड़े शे कौनो किन्तु पीती तैयार कौनो कुन दिन अमी सुने नीचे शे लेट करे चे अमी रियली सेटिस्फाइड जे आमर दिल भर शिक्षक तथा जीवने आमर � Along with Summit, we salute the nation builders. Moving on to our spellers, let's take a look at your scores after the third round. Saqib, leading with 130 points. Sadiq, 75 points. Nabila, 110 points. And Tasif at 90 points. Get ready for the final round, which is Spell Buzz. Spellers, you are aware of the rules. Just to recap, we will be asking you six buzz words. Two clues will be given. The first clue will have the number of letters in the word, along with the first letter and the English meaning. The second clue will have the letters in a jumbled manner. You know it's a buzzer round, so whoever presses the buzzer first will get to answer first. Listen to me carefully. If you press the buzzer after the first clue and give us the correct answer, 10 points. If it is incorrect, minus 5. And you cannot participate after the second clue. If you press the buzzer after the second clue and give us the correct answer, plus 5. If it is incorrect, minus 5. So please be very careful. Your scores are looking very good <laughs> and anything can happen. We are looking for the top scorer who will join us 
in the grand finale. But yet, there are another chance. Second and third positions, fellas, can compete in the playoff rounds. So keep that in mind as well. All right? All the very best. We are starting our final round, Spell Buzz. Spellers, the first buzz word is a seven-letter word. It starts with the letter C, and it means the customs and beliefs of a particular country or group. Nabila, C-U-L-T-U-R-E, culture. That is correct. All right, 10 points for you, Nabila. The second buzz word is a seven-letter word. It starts with the letter D, and it means a simple drawing using lines to explain where something is, how... Nabila, once again. D-I-A-G-R-A-M, diagram. That is correct. Beautiful, 10 more points. The third buzz word is an 11-letter word. It starts with the letter C, and it means make something physically stronger or more solid. Time's up. Going for the second clue, and you're playing for five points. The second clue is on your screen. And yes, Sadiq? Is it consolidation, C-O-N-S-O-L-I-D-A-T-I-O-N? You came close, but that is not correct. The correct word was consolidate, C-O-N-S-O-L-I-D-A-T-E, consolidate. Minus five, Sadiq. Bad luck. But anyways, moving on. The fourth buzz word is an eight-letter word. It starts with the letter B, and it means wave around in excitement. Time's up. We're going for the second clue. The second clue is on your screen. Yes, Sakib. Is it Brandish? B-R-A-N-D-I-S-H, Brandish. That is correct. Five points for you, Sakib. Moving on. The fifth buzzword is a six-letter word. It starts with the letter H, and it means person living in solitude due to religious reasons. Sakib. Harmit, H-E-R-M-I-T, Harmit. That is correct. Ten points for you, Sakib. Well done. Last buzzword. The last buzzword is a six-letter word. It starts with the letter F, and it means a type of violin. Nabila, F-I-D-D-L-E, fiddle. That is correct. Ten points for you, Nabila. All right, it's time to announce your final scores. Let's take a look. Sadiq, you're at 70 points. Thank you very much for being such a wonderful speller and being a part of this season. Thank you. A round of applause for him, please. And now, Tausif, at 90 points, and you are going for the playoff round. So there's another chance for you to compete for the grand finale position. All right, and a round of applause for a good job. Now, Sakib and Nabila, your scores are very close. Nabila at 140 points and Sakib 145 points. Congratulations. You are going to the grand finale. You are our second finalist and Nabila don't lose hope. There's another chance at the playoff and I'm sure you can make it there as well. All right. Congratulations. And thanks to everyone. Thanks a lot. It was a great semi-final. I'm sure you all will agree with me. And yes, indeed, we got our second finalist, Saki from Anand Aniketan Salat. Congratulations. আমাদের আগামী পর্বগুলো দেখার আমন্ত্রণ জানিয়ে রাখছি আমরা হাজির হয়ে যাব প্রতি বুধবার এবং বৃহস্পতিবার সন্ধ্যা সাতটা পঞ্চাশ মিনিটের চ্যানেল আয়ের পর্দায় বিদায় নেওয়ার সময় হয়ে গেছে যাওয়ার আগে মনে করিয়ে দিয়ে আমাদের চ্যাম্পিয়ন স্পেলার কি পেতে যাচ্ছে আমাদের চ্যাম্পিয়ন স্পেলারের জন্য অপেক্ষা করছে এই ট্রফি সেই সাথে ওয়াশিংটন ডিসিতে একজন অভিভাবক সহ ভ্রমণের সুযোগ ইটস টাইম টু সে বাই জয়েন মি আজ আই সে গুড বাই স্পেলিং
Shopping, got a bully. But I deal with your motto, Jolie.